Hi there. If your hard drive isn't showing up, don't worry, you're in the right place. Today, I'll walk you through practical solutions to recover your data and get your hard drive back in working order. Let's dive in. First, let's talk about a common scenario. You plug in your hard drive, but it doesn't show up in File Explorer or Disk Management. Sound familiar? Before jumping to conclusions, start with some simple checks. Make sure the connections are secure and try plugging the drive into another device or port. If that doesn't work, don't panic. The issue might be due to logical errors, corrupted partitions, or outdated drivers, all of which can be fixed. However, keep in mind that fixing these issues might overwrite and erase data. That's why recovering your files first is crucial. One of the best tools for data recovery is Ease Us Data Recovery Wizard. It's designed to quickly recover deleted files from SSDs, hard disk drives, memory cards, recycle bins, flash drives, digital cameras, camcorders, and more in just a few clicks. It even supports raw drives and RAID recovery. To start the recovery process for your files, First, launch the EaseUS Data Recovery Wizard on the computer. Choose a problematic drive and start scanning. Once the scan is complete, choose your lost audio, videos, or images. You'll see the Path and Type tab on the left side. You can also use the file name to locate your file. Then, choose your lost videos, photos, or images, and double-click it to preview the file to make sure it's the one you were looking for. And click Recover to get them back. Be careful not to revert the recovered files to the original location, since this would overwrite the file. With your data safe, let's move on to fixing the hard drive itself. The first method is assigning a drive letter. Sometimes the issue is as simple as missing or conflicting drive letter. To fix this, open Disk Management, right-click the problematic drive, and choose Change Drive Letter and Paths. Assign a new letter, and your drive should reappear. If that doesn't work, try running the Hardware and Devices Troubleshooter. This tool can fix minor configuration issues. To access it, type Troubleshoot in the Windows search bar, select the Hardware and Devices option, and follow the on-screen instructions. Another effective solution is using the Check Disk command to repair a raw drive or corrupted partition. While this command can be tricky, EaseUS Partition Master offers a free-to-use and more user-friendly alternative. With a clean interface, it simplifies disk repairs, no command line required. Open the EaseUS Partition Master on your computer. Locate the disk, right-click the partition you want to check, and choose Advanced Check File System. In the Check File System window, be sure to keep the Try to Fix Errors If Found option selected. Then, click Start. Now, EaseUS Partition Master will start checking your partition file system on the disk. And when it completes, just click Finish. For a brand new drive, initializing the drive is key. But just be aware that you will wipe all your data from your hard drive when you do this. So, I suggest you only try this when your hard drive is brand new or empty. If your hard drive shows as not initialized in disk management, EaseUS Partition Master can safely initialize it to MBR or GPT, depending on which one your computer needs. Then, you can create a new partition without losing data. To do this, just open EaseUS Partition Master and go to Partition Manager. From there, right-click the target disk and select Initialize to MBR or Initialize to GPT. Then, click Execute Task and Apply to save the changes. Easy, right? These solutions cover most logical errors, helping you recover your files and make your hard drive accessible again. EaseUS products make these processes simple and secure, with high success rates and an intuitive interface. Don't let a missing hard drive slow you down. Get back on track with these solutions. If you want to see more tips like this, be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.